It's Sunday, which means it's time for a Great Hour Running GPX Grand Prix update. Uh, there's a few people watching here right now live. That's the anonymous manatee, the anonymous turtle, and the anonymous buffalo. I don't know what the, the crane, the crane was here earlier, it's disappeared. Anyway, here we go, update for the 6th of June. If we look at the results, we've had loads of results in. Um, quite a few people have done the Salty Shaker. A few people have done the Tour de 28. In fact, let's mention our runners of the week, first of all. Um, firstly, where is she gone? Where is she gone? Jane Webster. Jane Webster is my first runner of the week. Uh, she has jumped from 10th to 3rd um, after a successful Tour de 28. And our other uh, runner of the week is Charles Reynolds Talbot, who took part in the, uh, the, the, the North Leeds Ultra Trail Race, um, even though the Leeds Triathlon was on in Round A Park, and he didn't find out until about 16 miles into it. So he diverted his own course, sort of went round the border fence and returned safely um, for a very good uh, time. Uh, so he's my mother runner of the week. Um, so let's have a look at the let's have a look at what's happened this week. Anyway, let's uh, just separate the agendas. Um, right now we've got a new top three. Actually, we've got Amy Young still in first place. Uh, we've got Rachel Bentley, I believe, is new in the uh, in the top three. It's quite tight actually in the top. I'd say the sort of top six or seven. Uh, the women is flop is still flooping around loads, moving around quite a lot. And if we go we go down to the men, and we've got Paul Milligan still in first place. Uh, we've got Mats Vermeeren after once again after a tour de twenty eight uh, has, has jumped up into second place, pushing uh, Richard Vowden and David Leslie into third and fourth respectively. Um, and there you go. There you can see you can see everything there. Um, once again, you can you can access these files. You can see them online, and you can use these tabs here to see the individual races. Now we have a few races closing soon, so we're going to have some closing parties. Uh, firstly, G1 Woodhouse Ridge uh, on Monday, the twenty eighth of June. Meet at seven o'clock. At Ridge Terrace, uh, more details will come up shortly. Um, it's like like I said before, it's a, it's a social gathering. It's not a um, it's not an event as such. It's a socially distant group run. Um, everyone's there. Everyone's invited to take part on their own on their own terms. Basically, run run a socially distant group or run on your own and try and get your best time before the race closes. Twenty uh, eighth of June, so that's a few days before the actual official closing time of the race. But that's we've organised it to be on a Monday night. Uh, you might have to um, you might have to miss your training run for that, or convince your training mates to come and do it. Uh, the Wykebeck Way again will be closing. Uh, at the end of June, so I suggest Monday the 21st of June, uh, 1900 hours at Round Day Park. So we'll do the Round Day to, we'll do the Round Day to 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 uh, Temple Newsom route. Uh, anything else to mention? New race coming soon. Rumbold's Lob. I'm not giving you much information about that yet. That is completely. Uh, on purpose so maybe the next week or two I'll get this uh, this next red race out um, if, as you can see here um, there's a star rating for each race now so that's the distance is, is three stars the terrain is four stars and the navigation is five stars that's probably one of our only five star navigation routes um, more on that later um, and that's everything for you today Hang on, I just I forgot one thing. One thing is that the Holly Hustle and the Wee Hustle are now open. Okay, back to the screen. That's all for now. Um, subscribe if you haven't, if you're watching this on YouTube, if you're watching this on Facebook, go to my YouTube page and subscribe to my YouTube page. Uh, put these out on YouTube now for everyone to see. Have a lovely weekend, I guess. Uh, see you soon.